I, I call this kind of the, the coolest boring study we've got because each year isn't necessarily a big splashy uh, um, eureka moment. But what this shows is that after 10, essentially 10 years of sap extraction at the highest level, so over half a gallon of syrup per tap, compared to much lower levels of extraction of essentially a quart per tap or so, there's no difference, even though you see some difference in the height of the bar, but if you factor in the variability, there is no significant difference between those three treatments. Which, you know, it, it's one of the first things we hear when we talk about, wow, sugar makers can make twice as much syrup from each tap. Um, folks who are concerned, folks who are invested in, in this industry or those who are just maybe aren't in the maple industry but are concerned, want to know, well, what's the effect on the tree? 10 years is a blip in the lifespan of this species. So again, another limitation, but it is encouraging, I would say, if you're concerned about the sustainability, that in 10 years there really isn't any difference. Even though this bar, yes, technically is lower, but when you do the stats, the variability is enough to, to show there's no difference. 